Welcome back! Guess who is 11 months old? This one! He's actually 11 months old on Saturday, but we're going to post this on Friday. So he's got two days away from being 11 months old. We thought this would be a good video to do today. It's going to be short because keeping him in this bed and entertained <laughs> is tough. So, let's get started. <laughs> He had a doctor's appointment on Monday and they weighed him and he was 21 pounds, 5 ounces. They didn't do a length measurement, but I don't think, again, I don't think he's gotten too much longer because he can still fit into some of his 9 months clothes. Uh, clothing wise, he is wearing 12 to 18 months. He's in size 4 diapers. He's got 7 teeth. 7. So he was very fussy over the Thanksgiving holiday. I don't know if that came across in the videos. But come to find out, it was because he was getting a new tooth. So now he has three teeth on the bottom and four teeth on the top. <laughs> he is um, getting a little closer to saying mama and daddy. He's making the ma 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 repetitive sounds. Same thing with daddy. He's been working. <laughs> he's been working on Bob, uh, light, hat. I think that's it. Uh, he still waves to everybody and everything. That's also what he does when he wants something. <laughs> he is crawling all over the place as fast as he possibly can. We do, we keep him in his little um, freestanding playpen. <laughs> I don't want that in my face. <laughs> because he is so fast and it's hard to keep a track of him and we know it's safe in there. But in the evenings we like to do what we call supervised crawling. So we'll let him crawl wherever he wants and we'll follow behind him and around him and make sure he doesn't get into trouble. He likes that. He is still cruising, that's pulling up and walking around the perimeter of things. He does that in his little pen, he does that in his crib, he does that in his pack and play. And the absolute newest development that he does is he is walking, full on walking, in his pack and play. Insert video clips. <laughs> I'll post the full video later. Oh, you're not going to put it in this one? I'll put a little bit in it. Oh, okay. So yes, he is taking steps in his pack and play, which is crazy. Uh, right before we sh started shooting this video, he was doing basically a baby mosh pit in pack and play, like throwing himself all over the thing. It's pretty crazy. He wore himself out. He's tried a couple of new foods. I've given him some bites of my oatmeal. He had some stuffing on Thanksgiving. Uh, he had a piece of cantaloupe. Like, I didn't give him a full piece of cantaloupe. I held the piece of cantaloupe while he took bites and he seemed to like that. I'm still terrified. I'm still terrified that he's going to choke on something. So, I'm really hesitant to give him any finger foods. But he eats baby. <laughs> baby mum mums and little creamies and yogis and his development hand-eye coordination to get the little discs of the creamies to his mouth is excellent he can pop them in there and not miss uh, we've moved on to or moved to a chunkier baby food because he got really irritated with the thinner smoother purees um, he just would get mad when you try to give him that. So we've moved to chunkier ones and he seems to like that. So the last video I talked about what we were considering uh, supplementing with formula, which we did end up doing because my milk supply never got any better. And so I probably pump during the day enough for one bottle for him during the day. And so we give him formula for the other two bottles and he really likes it. He drinks all of it. So we have no issues with that. He's actually up to six ounces in the formula bottles. 
Um, and we're working on getting him uh, two solid food meals a day. Right now, I think it's just one, but our goal is to do two. <laughs> All right. Sleeping wise, he's sleeping through the night. I'm <laughs> just kidding. <laughs> Uh, he's actually done really good this week. We've gotten a couple of four hour stretches in a row. So that makes me excited. Um, I kind of stopped doing the sleep training because he was getting up so often uh, every two hours and he would scream and cry and just wouldn't settle back down. And so I ended up just, um, every time he would do that, I've been nursing him also partly to try to keep my milk supply up. So we're not really doing much sleep training, but this week he's been falling asleep on his own for bedtime, which is really cool. He um, normally falls asleep when I nurse him, but he hasn't been nursing that much in the evenings because we've been giving him so many, so much solid food that he's not very hungry for milk. But as soon as I put him in his crib, he like rolls over and goes to sleep and it's amazing and he doesn't cry. That's happened every night this week, so that's really exciting for me. And progressively each night. What? <laughs> Look, can you tell how spitty this is? It's like, oh my goodness. <laughs> oh, that's funny. But progressively each night this week, he slept for a longer and longer stretch. <laughs> you see that we've uh, there's an, an assortment of toys, and he's picking all of the non-toy items to play with. So whatever keeps him entertained. Oh, incoming. Um, <laughs> one thing that I always intend to include in every single update video, but I manage to forget every time, and I think it's really cute and I'm bummed I forget it, is his nicknames, because every month we have a new nickname for him. So I thought that we would tell you what his nicknames are. So Jacob's favorite is Nugget or Nuggets. Hey, know. Nuggets! Is, is it because, why do you call him that? I don't know. I thought I it was think, something about Chicken Nuggets. I think he was my little Chicken Nugget. <laughs> but so nuggets, nuggets is just stuck and I've called him Nuggets ever since. And I find myself doing it every now and then. Uh, baby Man, Little Man. G-Man. G-Man, I don't call him. Who, no one calls him G-Man. My dad does. Oh, sorry. Sorry, Mr. Mike. <laughs> Papa calls you G-Man. Papa calls him G-Man. Um, Boo Boo. Peanut. Peanut. I do a lot of peanut. Do a lot of peanut. Baby. That's our general baby term. Any other nicknames? Nuggies. Every now and then I abbreviate nuggets and just call them nuggies. <laughs> so nuggets. I think I think nicknames are cute. That'll be fun. Cause my mom still calls me hello. Some of the nicknames that um, she's always called me growing up. So I think that's cute that we do that. <laughs> As for his likes and dislikes, he loves to walk. So if he doesn't like to be held for too long, if he's not in the mood for it. So what he wants you to do is put him on the ground and you hold his hands and he walks like he's in his walker. He goes as fast as he possibly can on his little tiptoes. He really, really likes that and gets a big kick out of it. He likes to, he likes one-on-one -on -one play time, uh, but he also is a really good independent um, player in his little playpen. He will entertain himself, which is <laughs> really nice. He likes music and he likes to dance, which you've seen in a couple of videos. There's no music playing, but he's still doing it. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> How spitty is this, baby? Um, as for dislikes, who does not like teething. <laughs> <sighs> he he dislikes disliking things. Or he if you take something away, oh oh, he gets <gasps> real mad. He started pitching fits. <laughs> he pitches full on tantrums. Will hold both arms on and shake and get so mad if you take something away from him. Like, don't it, show him. No, I was <laughs> I'm trying to find those ribbons. Where the ribbons go? They're very spitty. <laughs> He still really likes children and watching kids all around. He got to spend some time with his little cousin over the Thanksgiving break and really enjoyed that. He um, is really rough though, and you've seen that. 
and he does not know gentle with another baby, so we got to work on that. Um, he dislikes when everyone else is eating and he doesn't get to eat, and he will watch your mouth chew, <laughs> and he will try to chew. <laughs> His face is so red right now. Oh, eczema-wise, like all the other patches went away. <laughs> <laughs> but the worst is probably on the back of his neck. But um, we still are fighting that. Um, he's been around some Christmas lights. What? <laughs> he was biting on, hanging. He was hanging out of his mouth by the tag. He's been around Christmas lights and Christmas decorations. He still doesn't quite know what to make of it. We don't. We let him like touch the tree. But he never is has unfettered access to the tree because I think it would all come crashing down. But as you can tell, he is a wiggly, squiggly, adorable little chunk of a baby. And we are so happy every day that we get to be his parents. And I'm frankly terrified and so excited that next month will be his one year old update. You're going to be one years old. But it's insane to me. It's already here. <laughs> it's already here. But he's our sweet man and we love him. So, um, thank you for watching this video. Hope I wasn't too rambly. Felt a little bit like Jacob every now and then. Give it a like if you like these updates that we do. Tell us in the... No. <laughs> Give it a thumbs up. <laughs> Tell us in the comments. Um, how your baby was at 11 months old. Oh, and if you have any first birthday ideas, because we got to start planning that. So, I think we're going to call it here. I hope you all have a good night, and we will see you later. Bye. Say bye. 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 No. I'm not going to happen. <laughs> Thanks for watching.